Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Inigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we're taking a look at Visio 2021 and some of the new features that Microsoft has brought to this program. Now, if you wanted your own copy of Microsoft Visio, Microsoft Office, or other Microsoft software for a great price, check out Inigo Software. We'll have all the links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's begin today's video. So the first new feature brought by this version of Visio is the Microsoft Azure Diagrams. So for me, I see it here at the top as one of my template options. I could also click new and click it from here, or we could simply search for it. And then by clicking on it, I have various templates. I'm gonna select the blank one and we'll press create. And this is going to allow us to use this particular diagram for our Azure project. On the left, you can see a ton of different options that we can use in this particular project. Number two on the list is AWS diagrams. So just like Azure, we have diagrams within Visio set up for Amazon Web Services. So I'll click on new and I'm gonna search for AWS. There it is, we can click on this. And you can kind of sum this up based on the uh, description that Visio is giving us. This template contains a set of symbols or icons to visually represent features and systems that use Amazon Web Services. So same thing, we can click on this and it's gonna be customized for AWS. Next on the list, we have mobile app wireframes. And to find this, I'm back in my file, new, and I'm just gonna search mobile app. And then by clicking on this and selecting a template, uh, let's go with this one here, we'll press create. This allows us to have a mock-up for a mobile app and all within Visio. So very nice feature that they added. Now the next feature in Visio 2021 is dark mode. So in our file tab, we're gonna scroll down to account and then we can select office theme and we have some various different options here. So your standard dark mode would be the black one. We could do colorful and dark gray. Next on the list for the new features, we have better collaboration. So I'm working on my flow chart here and we can actually have several people work on this diagram simultaneously. And to do that, we're just gonna click share and we'll save to cloud. And then here we have to click on OneDrive. So we'll double click that. Okay, we'll press save. And now at this point, I can invite people. I can change the permissions, whether I want them to view or edit. Again, several people can work on this simultaneously, which, which is a pretty awesome addition to Visio. The next thing we wanted to cover is check accessibility. This was also added to the other software included with Microsoft Office 2021. Uh, clicking into our review tab, if we click on check accessibility, we're now gonna be prompted with different warnings and errors that Visio found and that we should go in and check out. Next on the list, we're gonna go over to insert and we're gonna click on pictures and we have an option here called stock images. This was also added to Excel, PowerPoint and Word, but it's a really nice feature because we have some preloaded stock images that we can use straight within the program without having to go to our computer or to the web. Now, another thing added to this version of Visio is an updated draw tab. So we have different colored pens, we have different thicknesses by default, and we have a couple of various new tools that we can use while creating different diagrams or flowcharts. And the next new feature is the search bar. In any of our tabs, we have a search bar at the very right, and we can search for specific tools or settings. Now, the last thing that we're gonna cover in today's video is picking the perfect color. So in our home tab, I'm gonna check this font color and then we're gonna click more colors and then clicking over to custom. At the bottom, I have a custom hex key that I can put in. So if you want to exactly color match something that you already have in your diagram or something from the internet, with that hex key, you can plug that in and you will dial it in exactly. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you guys found it helpful, be sure to drop us a like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. Again, if you're interested in your own copy of Visio or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Inigo Software. We'll have all those links down in the description box below. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.